All right, day 93, 93 consecutive days of walking at least one mile. Coming to you live from Redondo Beach, California. We put the camera on, we'll get going. I think Ranger wants some food first. Come on, buddy, you want some food? You hungry? Come on. Come on, buddy. Are you in the mood for a shake hands today? Shake? Yes? No? You want to shake? There you go. <laughs> That's a half-hearted shake. That'll do. Alright, let's get some food for you. Here you go, buddy. Come on. You already had breakfast. Now you have some lunch. Oh, yeah. He's going for it. The hungry guy. Alright, let me put the camera on. We'll get going. Uh, all right. Uh, nice and sunny, beautiful today. Whew. About 68 degrees. Mr. Blue Sky going on. Got a rose happening right here. Look at that. All right. Gonna have about, look at all the rosebuds on this rose tree, bush. Gonna have about a hundred roses in the next week or two. All right. Uh, somebody throwing away a whole bunch of junk here. Goodness. The heck is going on here? All right. Start the timer. Put in your guesses how long it'll take, how far I'll go. Subscribe, stick around till the end. We'll see what Ranger's up to when I get back. See what we got going on today. All kinds of stuff yesterday. Saw this tree that, that has no leaves on it this time of the year. Like a brown tree. And then uh, I didn't know how it, how it worked, but it looks like it has uh, red bows on it, on a brown tree. And I never, I had never seen one up close until yesterday. And then yesterday I saw one up close, and what happens is, it's like pine cones. They look like pine cones on the tree. And uh, they turn, they're, they're miniature pine cones, and they turn red, and they're soft. I felt one yesterday, you can see it. Uh, if you want to see it yesterday, go check that out. But they, uh, the pine cones turn red, and then they open up to uh, like, uh, almost look like a flower. So there are all these like, uh, but they, when you, from far away, it looks like a brown tree with red bows tied on it. It's beautiful. It's down, uh, down Marine, there's like 50 of those trees all lining up and down, and they all turn, they're all brown, with like red bows on it. But what happens is they're like pine cones. And the pine cones turn red and open up and make make they look like little like flowers on the red tree, but no leaves, just just the red look like red bows on a brown tree. But that was cool. So you see one up close uh, yesterday. Pretty neat. And, uh, what else did I see? I saw a truck. It was from the fifties. I don't know. Because it, uh, it taken all the, they'd been repainted and they took all the insignias off. So I don't know if it was a Ford, a Chevy, it could have been a Dodge. Uh, I'm not sure what it was. I don't know if I'm going to count the Teslas today. I'm kind of on Tesla overload the last couple days. Yesterday and the day before. In Manhattan Beach. You check out that one from Manhattan Beach. I'll talk about that one in a minute. I must have seen, I don't know, each 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 walk I saw at least 20. So yesterday I walked three three walks yesterday. I must have seen 60 Teslas. And the day before that in Manhattan Beach, I bet I saw 30 or 40. It's like every house has a Tesla. Just unbelievable. So I'm kind of on Tesla overload. So yesterday I saw the tree, brown tree with the red bows and 
truck from the 1950s. It's kind of cool. But I don't know what it was. It was kind of turquoise and uh, white. Could have been uh, the, the original colors, but it was painted, repainted. So I don't know what, what truck it was, what make, what model, nothing. And uh, I don't know anything about it. It looked like it was from the 50s though. That was pretty neat. I don't see a lot of cars from the 50s. I saw a 58 Lincoln Continental. It was the same, same colors, basically. It's, it's somewhere in this neighborhood that I walk, but I'm going to try to walk a little bit different route today because I've been down there a hundred times. Not a hundred, but multiple times. Go down here back. If I go beyond the school a little bit, not too much exciting stuff at the school though and it's kind of a long walk so to get beyond the school so I guess I'll go around the block of the school and then uh, what else did I see yesterday there's something else so I saw a friendly black lab <laughs> it's pretty much the highlights of yesterday the day before that was in Manhattan Beach and then I saw a uh, house uh, Shaq used to live in and also uh, Jared Goff's house. He was a quarterback for the Rams and he got traded to Detroit. So now he plays for Detroit, but he keeps his house here and he bought the house next door, which was apparently $10 million and he's going to tear it down. At least that's what they say. I don't know. But I, it's not real clear uh, which house is his in the video, but because I really didn't know which one it was, but I do have a clear view of it. And it's not gated off or anything, but I really didn't know which one it was, but it is on the video. So that was pretty interesting. And just a lot of really, yeah, motorcycle. Really interesting things in Manhattan Beach. Huge houses, great views, the Pacific Ocean. About 4,000 Teslas. Every house, uh-oh, uh here comes an ambulance. Something's going on. Let's see what's happening. People are not really pulling over that much. That's not good. get out of the way one car pulls over other cars are just following right in goodness that's something it goes about five teslas the baseball field look at that red dirt yes that's dirt i'm not sure Cemetery. Maybe I'll walk over there on Memorial Day. Pretty big cemetery. It's not huge, but pretty big. Kids aren't out playing today. That's kind of weird. It's a beautiful day, lunchtime. I think they'd, they'd be out. I don't see anybody. Yesterday I walked by that school, there were tons of kids. They were playing kickball. I haven't played kickball since I was a kid. That was like they were having a good old time. All right. I walked down this street. I've driven on this street and walked on this street. But I don't think I've ever walked on this street for the channel. We'll see what's going on down here. More Teslas. Every car, every other car is a Tesla. It's unbelievable. All right, just in time for the light change. And I'm going down the street. 
see what we see down here oh boy look at dead end not a through street oh well go see what's going on they got a couple pigs in their yard you see that the two pigs that's something got a boat here I'm trying to take the boat out on the ocean sometimes I guess it's a fish looks like a fishing boat in a gray Mercedes van you go on trips on that looks like a nice van rebel sprinter two mountain lover I guess I go in the mountains somewhere Lake Tahoe or somewhere I don't know what is this a Wrangler a Rubicon pretty big Jeep Oh, there's the lab barking at me. Good thing he was tied up. Looked like he was not happy. There's another boat. A couple boats around here. There's a crow and an eyeball. What's going on there? Oh no. I hear some kids playing down here. Look how the kids are over at this school. A yellow, a yellow door over here. Huh? Don't need to wave if you don't want to. You stare me down, but no wave. A yellow door. More Teslas. I'm not counting them today. Let's see how many dogs will we see? One dog. It's a bunch of schools through here. Huh? School takes up like four blocks or something. Walk down here and see what we see. Already at a half a mile. We're never going to get back. We walk up. Probably have to walk up this street or something and come back. Let's walk around this school. I've walked around this school before. It took like a half an hour just to get around the school. It's a long walk. I think it's like two or three schools and a middle school and a elementary school. And they just take up like three blocks. Humongous. A bunch of kids out over here, but on that other one, there's nobody out. Yeah, there's some red cars here. A red truck and a red, uh, and a red car. I don't know what it is. Hyundai or something. Let's see. So go on down another block. Come up the next street. This sidewalk's blocked off here. Yesterday I did three walks. Today I'm just doing one. All right, let's see. Anything looks interesting up this street. So lock up and see if we see what we see. Bumpy yard. It's weird. I don't know what that's about. It's all bumpy. I don't know how they mow it unless it's fake. Maybe it's fake. I wonder what those little flowers are. They're kind of cool. I don't know about that yard. Weird. It's bumpy. 
I don't know. There's a yard with a couple chairs out in the middle of the yard. Kind of a cool house. Kind of modern for this street. short little streets through here. It's kind of a western desert type house. I don't know why the architecture looks just kind of looks like New Mexico-ish. This is the sandstone architecture that a lot of windows. I like that. Interesting gate over here. And check that out. Weird. It's kind of like a drawbridge doors or something. Where they got those doors? Maybe they're off a ship or a castle. Something. To go a little bit more. Where are we? Wow. It's across the street. Walk down this one little cul-de-sac up here. I guess we go up and back up, down this one and back up the other way. Get up two streets. I don't know if I've ever been down here before. They got look at that. We got a elephant, a lion, and seahorses and a fountain. Something. There's the elephant, and there's a lion. I don't know if I've ever walked on this street before. Or I don't, know, I don't think I've ever driven on it. I don't know. Maybe. I don't think so. Now, many dogs. One dog. One barking lab. I think that's it. No delivery trucks. No workmen. Here goes the train. You see it? Going behind these houses. Santa Fe. Oh, yeah. Yeah, loud. We're going to be gone before we get up there. Can't get that close to it anyway. Saw the train, what, about five days ago? It's almost right next to it a few days ago. This one looks a little bit bigger. Longer, rather. It goes by. It's been going by about this time. I say about the same time. Really, oh, look at this house. It's kind of Victorian again. Kind of cool. Definitely Victorian looking. And this one is not. Ah. And a lot of tanker trucks. Tanker. I don't know what they're calling back there. Oil? I don't know. It's a lot of them though. That's the last one. No caboose. There's a VW. Turquoise house, seafoam green, and an RV. We've seen several RVs lately. That train is right behind their house. 
Got another barking dog. What's going on with the dogs today? I don't want to bark. I guess uh, I never walked back here before. I think it's a uh, neighborhood that goes right up to the graveyard up here, cemetery. Sebring from the 80s and like a Jaguar from the 80s back there. And another Tesla. I'm not counting them today. Tesla it out. About a half a billion Teslas. All right. No outlet. Looks like an outlet. Yeah. So I walk up this. Uh, little small street and head back uh-oh beware of dog again what's going on with all the dogs today uh, beware of them two dogs are really barking at me today uh, what's going on over on this little street oh, wow building a nice house here look at that wow Definitely the nicest house on the street. Uh, definitely the most expensive house. Uh oh, another dog's barking. What's going on? Wow. I'm not happy. People are all kinds of barking dogs today. I didn't even see that one. Uh-oh, there's a bunch of free stuff. Junk. I don't want any of that. It's free. Let's throw that stuff away. Think somebody's going to take it home? I don't know. Yeah, didn't really see any vintage cars, per se. Any cool ones. It's not a Victorian looking house. Get another mile in. Keep the streak alive. 93 days in a row. Going for 100. See if I can get to 100 days in a row. Think I'll probably make it. Now if you're playing along, write down how many days in a row this is for you you've done 20 30 40 40 50 days in a row trying to do a mile a day or half a mile a day whatever you can get started with and if you haven't started write down your goal in the comments section say people with written goals are 10 times more likely to achieve the goal than if you just think about it so write it down come back every day And get across here without getting hit. Now, that's a few kids out there playing now. Maybe it was uh, class time for. Man, this is really a wonky walk here. Time for. Uh, period change there, changing classes. It's, yeah, there was nobody out there because there's a hundreds out there now. This is an uneven walkway over here. I've never walked this way for the channel before. I don't think I'll be doing it again. It's too uneven. I feel like crossing the street. Walk on the level ground. Oh boy, it's kind of a nightmare. Maybe I can cross the street, I don't know. Yeah, just be out of this in a minute. A lot of kids out there now, look at them. 
Must have been a period change or something. Uh oh, there's a bunch of cars. I'm never gonna get out of this. Very uneven walkway. Too many cars. Remind me not to walk on this side of the street again. All right, just a little better now. This is adjacent to the cemetery and not much to see here. Yeah. Always interesting to do a different type of walk. You never know what you're going to see. I will probably not revisit this walk again. <laughs> oh boy. Just kind of speeding through the cemetery. Here he comes out. Get out of the way. There he goes. A speed racer. Now he's racing up to the red light where he thinks he's going to hit the brakes. Slow down. What he's doing. To race up to the red light and stop, I guess. I have to choose a different route tomorrow. We did a different route today that I've never done before, but a big old truck, but not much to see on this route they go through the neighborhoods where all the cars and the houses are not on the street thing is you had to walk a little bit to get to the neighborhoods on this route so yesterday was all through the neighborhoods hell no one place i walked down the street for a half a mile In Manhattan Beach, there was nothing but neighborhoods. But I drove to that. I didn't drive today. Ugh, it's getting kind of hot. Ugh. Look at that little thing. A uh, little three-wheeler, looked like a three-wheel golf cart or something. I don't know if I caught it on camera very well. Well, here comes another Tesla. I bet I saw another 20 today. Just walking down the road for a bit, so. Got a green light. Is she not moving? What's she doing? Just sitting there, I guess. Oh, she did. Was trying to turn. She had a red light. No, maybe we got that three wheeler on camera. That'd be pretty cool. Never seen a vehicle like that before. It looked like a golf cart with three wheels, but it was not a golf cart. Warm today, shorts. Got a long sleeve shirt on, but I probably could have gone with a short sleeve shirt. Yesterday I had a jacket on. Wait, eight, ten, de eight degrees cooler yesterday. All right, 
get back and see what Ranger's up to. I'm sure he's asleep. Trying not to sit on his tail. Sit on his tail again yesterday or day before. The chairs are wrought iron and uh, he lifts his tail up when I come in and then I sit down and his tail goes, he walks under the chair and then part of his fur gets under the chair and accidentally sit on it. He's not happy about that. It sounded like Woodstock from his Snoopy cartoons. I didn't know I was sitting on it. He's screaming and yelling. I think that was yesterday at the end of the video or day before. Well, it must have been yesterday. And another Tesla. Goodness gracious. I've never seen so many Teslas in my life. I don't even want to count them anymore. Muscle cars, I only think I saw like one today. Three barking dogs. What's going on with all those dogs that were barking today? They're barking at me, I didn't even see him, one of them. Or maybe, no, I think I saw two of them. One that was really barking is a lab. Ugh. I'm kind of tired today. All right. I did another mile, kept the streak alive. Let's see. Might cut off on me before I get to Ranger. I'll see if I get up there. Good. Two one hundreds more to go. All right. If you guessed one point four six and thirty minutes and nineteen seconds, you are the winner. Nice walk today. This junk here. I don't know. They're waiting for the garbage man to come or something. Let's see what Ranger's up to. I, don't know, I could put this up here for Ranger to sit on. He'd probably like it. put it you know, put it on top of the grill maybe we'll see if I don't like it I'll throw it out see if he likes it uh -oh, I already hear him why are you doing little guy you're hanging out put some cushions up here and see if you like sitting on those I know you like sitting up high let's we'll see if you sit up there all right. What are you doing, little buddy? Yeah, don't get under the chair today. Ugh. There you go. Yeah, his tail goes up there. Cat's happy to see you. Their tail goes up. It's like a dog wagging his tail, but cats put theirs up. All right, buddy. That's it for the walk today. If you'd like it, check out some of the other videos. Like I said, uh, Yesterday with that brown tree with the red bows on it, that was something. Looked like red flowers. And uh, day before that, Manhattan Beach, saw Shaq's old house. Always something. 53 Corvette. That was a couple, that was like a month ago. All kinds of stuff. Well, that's it. New video tomorrow again, 10.30. Bye.